In this video, I will show you common line version of .NET Upgrade Assistant. As I mentioned before, .NET Upgrade Assistant is the tool that will help you port in your application to the latest .NET. There are two flavors available. One is Visual Studio Extension and the other one is a global command line tool, which we will look at in this video. So to get this tool on your machine, you can simply type .NET tool install slash G upgrade assistant. And if you already have this tool on your machine, you can easily update it with the update command. Once you have it on your machine, then in the console, you can simply type .NET, uh, simply type upgrade dash assistant and first i'm going to call it without any parameters and that way i will see help so here you can see their uh, options dash h or help version to find out what is the version of the current tool and there is one command upgrade and for that command we can specify some parameters such as operation and um, the target framework, but you can also run it without any parameters and then tool will ask you for those inputs in the interactive mode. That's what I'm going to do. I am already in the folder uh, where my solution is that I want to upgrade. And here, this is the solution. It's a simple demo app in Visual Studio and it is targeting .NET Framework 4.8. I want to move it to the latest .NET and I'm going to use it with .NET command line tool. So I navigate it to the folder where my code is and I'm going to call upgrade the system upgrade. Now the tool will ask me, do I want in-place project upgrade or side-by-side -side project upgrade? Just to remind you, in-place will modify my original code and side-by-side -side will create a copy and upgrade the copy. I'm going to choose in-place. And the second question the tool is asking me, which is the target framework that I want to move to? And it is going to offer you the long-term support at the moment you're writing the tool, the uh, standard term support, or the preview. Once we release .NET 8 in November, the long-term support will be .NET 8. So I'm going to choose .NET 8. And uh, the tool tells me they gathered all the required options, and it asks if I want to continue. Yes. Now the tool will output everything that is happening to my project and all the changes and modifications the tool does. And just in a few seconds, it says it completed 14 files were successfully updated, 10 files were skipped. So let's go back to Visual Studio. Here I will need to reload my project because my project file has been changed. And once I look at properties of this project, I will see that now it is targeting .NET 8. So the tool just successfully upgraded my project from .NET, 4 point, .NET Framework 4.8 to the latest .NET 8. Just to recap, in this video, you learned about command line version of .NET Upgrade Assistant that helps you to move to the latest .NET. And you can get this tool at aka.ms slash .NET UA dash cmd thank you for watching and happy porting